Um, Matt has talked the last couple of weeks about getting you going. Mm -hmm. How do you, how does that happen for you? How do you get yourself going? How do you get a little bit more production out of, you know, granted, limited minutes that you're playing right now? Um, I think it's just, you know, just continuing to play. And just uh, continue to go hard every day. And um, it's just kind of one of those things. You just got to kind of get through the, the droughts or, you know, I didn't play it all last year. I you know, barely practiced. So, like, just being in game, um, going through different experiences is just, like, a, a lot of things are new for me. So, I think it's it's all been good. It's all very valuable for learning. Even though you, you, you know go, going in you're going to have limited minutes, is there any – do you push yourself? Okay, I gotta, I gotta accomplish this, and in, in the minutes I'm going to be in there, or just kind of let things flow the way they flow. Um, I don't know. I've I've tried different mindsets <laughs> at different games, um, but no, I think it's just kind of just doing what you do every day. Um, you know, he's Coach Paints. He's ran plays for me while I'm in there. I just haven't, you know, I haven't scored. I haven't been productive off of him uh, right now. But you know, from I, I have full confidence in myself that, you know, I said I'll come back, so. Right. When you talk about you've had different mindsets, kind of run through what you've kind of, those mindsets that you've tried to use. Yeah, I mean, yeah, just going out there and, uh, like, trying to attack, um, going out there and just knowing, you know, focusing more on, um, I guess, securing every defensive possession, just going out there. Just different things you can think about during the game, like, um, like nailing the scouting report every single time. So there's just different mental things I like to try to do and um, just figure out before every game. Where do you feel like you've had the this, this success when you've been in there here recently? Um, I mean, it's, it's a little difficult, like you said, because of limited minutes. Um, but, you know, whenever I've been able to get in the game and just kind of get comfortable with everything that's going on is when I've uh, had the most success. So it's kind of hard to, it's just kind of hard to go in there and with the limited minutes be as, um, I'm not going to say locked in, it's just kind of a comfort thing, to be honest. Are you a guy that needs to kind of get lathered up a little bit to get, you know, get more minutes? Or do you feel like you, from the jump, once you get in the game, you can be, you can be as productive as you can? I mean, the goal is to, as soon as you get in the game, be as productive as possible. Um, that's what I would, you know, like to, you know, say that for myself. Obviously, you're more comfortable the the, the more time in game that you get. Um, but no, it's just like I said, it's one of those things where it's a learning experience for me, and you know, something I'll grow from and take lessons from. Um, but part of that's also trying to get in a rhythm too, right? Right. Right. Yeah. I mean, do you feel like you've you've accomplished that? Uh, um, this season, mean? just in general. In general, maybe not from the beginning to the to the end, but or where we're at now. But in, in, are there games that come to mind where you felt like, yeah, I was in a pretty good rhythm there? And yeah, well, I mean, um, I actually don't remember who we played that game. Uh, but the game Zach was out, um, but it was just kind of one of those things where I just got, you know, again more minutes that game. So it was just a little bit more. I don't know. You just get in the zone more as an athlete. I don't know how to explain it any better than that. But right. like when you know that you know you're going to be in and getting getting touches, getting opportunities, getting um, you know certain things, and you just get more comfortable with the game. Right. But like you said, the goal is to be able to go out there and if I if I get one touch, if I get two minutes, be you know try to do as much as I can in that two minutes. Mm -hmm. So do you, when you when you look past. The scoring. What do you feel like you've done well in some mm -hmm. of the other areas? Yeah, um, I mean, really, it's just I think the big thing is just knowing the scout and knowing like when I get in the game, who am I going to be facing up against? I think the days that I've done that the most, um, I think that's been the best. Mm -hmm. I talked to you in the summer, and one of the, one of your goals was to make sure that this team was a better defensive team mm -hmm. uh, during the season. Yeah. Do, you, do you do you see that? Do you feel like this team has is is in that direction and in that kind of zone now from a defensive standpoint? Yeah, I mean for sure. Um, I see me personally, I still have uh, work to do <laughs> in that area, but 
I think as far as I think no one would doubt, even from like a mentality standpoint, this team is much better defensively. We just we care about that side of the ball, and I think that shows. You know, when, when players on the team are trying to do the right thing, you know, if they if they mess up, that's that's fine. But it's you know, when when, when players don't care, it's not that valuable. Um, that's what kind of hurts the, the culture of the team. But I think with this team, everybody on the floor that goes out there is gritty, you know, wants to play hard and wants to do it for the team. And they, they all listen to what um, the coaches are saying. So I think it really makes us – obviously it helps in offense too, but I think it helps us really defensively. Well, how is the approach different this year? How is mine? Or no, how, just as a team, how is the defense approach different? Um – I mean, I don't know if it's, I don't know how much of it's just the coaches or, you know, the new guys that we've gotten. I mean, obviously as a point guard, Braden kind of, you know, he starts a lot of that. Just, just with how he plays, he changes the dynamics of the game. I think his, his speed and how he utilizes it, it kind of really sparks the team and a defensive mindset. Obviously there's people that have came back. Caleb's came back. Mace's came back. Um, players have gotten older. So I think that really helps just, you know, with experiences, you know, experience a lot when you're out there. Um, and really it's, you know, I think that's what it is. Obviously Morty has a bigger role this year, and I think, you know, he's kind of shown how great of a defender that he is. So, um, yeah, I just think it's the guys that we have. I think they've, you know, done a great job of recruiting guys that really care about that side. Good deal.